You're watching Jake and Amir. Hey, give me your hat. Whoa, bad hair. That's why I'm wearing a hat. Okay, dude, sorry, but you have to stop posting on Reddit. Relax, I only post cool and interesting stories. At most, one a month. You posted 3,900 times today. I said at most. Then you're using that word wrong. You're a bigger circle jerking demon than the commenters, and that's saying a lot. Right, the last thing you uploaded 30 seconds ago was a picture of the guy from Futurama with, I think this is your dick. It's not. Photoshopped onto his forehead. Oh yeah, it is. The text, not sure if y'all commenters are a bunch of circle jerking divas or if I'm universally hated by everybody. It's the second thing. It's called a meme. No, it's called a meme. Wow, you know, you also try to start a ton of AMAs. I'm a coward and a fool whose dad moved out on him not once, not 12, but a dozen times. Ask me anything? Yeah. My dad is a diva. Ask me anything? Yeah. I'll go dickless for Michael Chickless. Ask me almost anything? Yeah. What is that? AMAs, okay? It's like an interview. It stands for ask me any time. Wrong. What the fuck is going dickless for Michael Chickless? I needed the upvotes. You never get any upvotes. You have thousands of downvotes. It's called karma, Jake. And correct me if I'm wrong. <laughs> But I got a lot of it. You are wrong. Then correct me. What are these hundreds and hundreds of posts on our trees? Just picture after picture of you trying to light a joint, your eyebrows on fire, and you're crying and smiling. I'm an ent that needed the uptokes. Okay, right, I see that. I'm high as a knife, ask me anything. If this gets a thousand uptokes, I won't kill myself? So sad. How's this for sad? I was at a three when I wrote that. That is sad, because that's not very high, and you went to a really dark place, threatening to kill yourself in an online community where everybody hates you. Well, you just uptoke it, okay? I'll go dickless for chickless literally this afternoon if you uptoke it. I won't, because you know what? Your comments on all these other posts are actually really mean. Like oh, on this video of a dog- One example. Are you give me I'll, one I'll example. I'll give you a ton of examples, okay? Like on this video of a dog squealing with joy when his soldier owner comes home. I already know what you're gonna say, okay? Just know that I did it for the lulz. You did this for lulz. Why the bitch is this on the front page? Am I the only one that thinks dogs aren't cute or capable of having real emotion? Yeah. If this gets downvoted, I'll shut up. My dick is off for Michael Chick if this gets one more devote. And guess what, man? Hundreds of downvotes. Really? Yeah, do you not check? Do you follow up at no, all? No, I never go back. You would be depressed if you went through your Reddit history, okay? Here's another picture posted here of the Pope and the caption says, Praise for starving children while sitting on a golden throne. <laughs> what, you think that's funny now? Because yeah. you didn't when you left this comment. Atheist fucks going to hell for talking smack about this God guy. Bury me with downvotes if you disagree. You know, why do you, why do you ask for the downvotes? I'm like a martyr. But if you agree, meet me at Blockbuster because we're renting Rampart and then ramming each other's farts. Then, right under that, you write, Commenter above me is a philosopher. Upvote him to karma heaven. Right under that, you write, I'm the Pope in this picture, ask me anything. That thread was dead. Stop trying to protect yourself. You're coming up with excuses. Just admit, nobody on Reddit likes you. Nobody likes me. This guy, For the Wolf X, replied to you saying, leave Reddit alone, love everybody. And his comment got thousands of upvotes. Oh. And in response, you decided to post a picture of Calvin trying to piss on Michael Chickless, but there's no P. Yeah, guess why? Did he go dickless? He went dickless for him. Yeah, exactly right. Ask him anytime.